<sighs> Man, I'm thirsty. Let's go get some water. Hmm. <laughs> What? I can't believe you drink tap water. What are you talking about? Bottled water is safer, it tastes better, and I just like it. I can't believe you didn't learn your lesson. I mean, didn't you see what happened in Flint, Michigan? There was lead in their water. Do you know what that does to a young child's brain development and can cause high blood pressure in adults? Yeah, you're gonna trust the water but not every town is like Flint, Michigan. That situation was mainly due to a combination of changing their source water and not having environmental engineers account for that when they were doing their calculations. And that led to decalcification of their pipes and the release of lead into their water. So that was a pretty terrible situation, but not every town is gonna be like that. I don't believe you. If you don't trust our tap water, why don't we just check the county website? The EPA states that every public water system has to report what the water quality is like on an annual basis. We can just check what this year's water is like. Okay. Well, here we go. It shows every substance and the unit measurement of allowed concentrations, and it tells if it's in violation with the EPA regulations of the Drinking Water Act. If you look on this website right now, it says that we're not in violation for any of these contaminants, including lead, chlorine, chloramines, nitrates, copper, even total coliform bacteria. Lies, fake news, conspiracy. Well, Another website you can check is the Environmental Working Group. The Environmental Working Group also does its own nonprofit study on the water quality across the nation. I just don't trust that website. They could be telling us anything and just putting it on the internet. Well, if you don't trust the website, why don't we just test it ourselves? We can just order a test kit real quick and do analysis of our own water. Here, I'll go right now and make an order. Oh, I think it's here. Well, look, I just did a test on all of our water and it meets the EPA standards for every level of contaminant being tracked. I think we're safe to drink the tap water. Nice try with the test kit. I see what you did there. It's good to know that we don't have those things present in our water, but that doesn't solve the fact that there's tons of other chemicals that are present and they don't regulate every contaminant I'm gonna stick to my bottled water. Don't you know that plastic bottled water is basically tap water, but in a plastic container? All they do is simple filtration and then charge you a premium. <coughs> uh, <coughs> what? That's so gross. I feel like my whole life is a lie. You're right. There are chemicals that are not regulated by the EPA that could be present in our water but there are ways that we can mitigate those issues by adding filters before we drink our water. Things like a carbon filter coming from like a Brita or a reverse osmosis system that you can install into your faucet can easily clean out a lot of those contaminants that you would worry about. Those filtration systems not only clean up the chemicals and the particulate matter and any of the bacteria that you're worried about, but they can also filter out things that make your water smell weird or taste funny. Well, tap water is, look, this is what you really need to know about tap water. The FDA oversees the quality of bottled water while the EPA regulates the drinking water standards for tap water. Overall, the EPA does more testing on our water than the FDA. And if you're curious about what's present in your bottled water, you're less likely to know because that's part of the consumer business information. Bottled water is almost two 
thousand times more expensive than tap water. And let's not forget that the accumulation of plastic in our environment is a huge issue. Every day, over 60 million plastic bottles are thrown away and end up accumulating in our landfills and later in our environment. And once they pollute our environment, they can release toxic chemicals into our waterways and the ecosystem. We do have to remember that the FDA and the EPA only regulate a certain number of chemicals in our water. And those limits for contamination have not changed in the past 20 years. If you have concerns about your water and would like to remove other contaminants, you can always purchase either a carbon filtration system or reverse osmosis system for your faucet. So I think you should give tap water another try. Well, I guess you make a lot of sense there. Here, I'll get you some. Thanks. states that America has some of the cleanest water in the world. So take advantage of it. Pick up your drinking water and stop buying that bottled water. Poppy, is this safe? I don't know. Let's try it. She likes the bottled water. If you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. If you have any other questions about water quality, please post them in a comment below. Thank you for watching.